and three. The Bible says, after these things, the word of the Lord came to Abraham in a vision, saying, Fear not, Abraham. I am thy shield and thy exceeding great reward. Verse 2. And Abraham said, Lord God, what will you give me? Seeing that I go childless and the steward of my house is this Eliezer of the master. And Abraham said, Behold, one born to me. And Abraham said, Behold to me, thou hast given no seed. And lo, one born in my house is my heir. When I first read this passage, I was, by the way, my voice is not. Uh, go today uh, a bit, a little bit of trauma. Um, maybe fatigue. My, 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 yeah, I think it's a bit of fatigue. But I do hope that it will get through today. I'm sure tomorrow we will be okay. So we pray that for now uh, the voice will get us through the, you know, the discourse for the evening. I'm sure by tomorrow. The voice to its original frequency, if we can use that term. I don't know whether you've read this passage before. I'm not sure whether you've encountered the passage we've just read this night. But the first time you read it, I was surprised. The first time I encountered this passage, I was taken back a little bit. Verse 1 to 3. You know the story that at this moment, Abraham is well advanced in years. By this point, Abraham is well advanced in years. And when you are that old, as he was,
Let's <laughs> 
in Genesis chapter 22. And this is what the Bible says in Genesis chapter 22. The Bible says, the Bible says, in this book, the Bible says, and the Lord said, Oh, I see. 
conference session. I was attending a conference session in a in our, in our conference. We were attending the conference session. At the end of the conference session, there were those choosing of leaders. Those choosing of leaders, the president of the conference, the executive secretary, the treasurer of the conference, departmental leaders, and so forth and so forth. When the leaders were finally announced, when the leaders were unveiled, they will announce remarks on me. The conference session was over. They asked the seven pastor to come and give some closing remarks. And this is what I want to quote now. This is what he said. Being in the nominating committee has been a difficult assignment. Purely because we have been choosing between good and good. We have been choosing between good men of God and good men of God. So it doesn't be easy to decide which one should be president. Because when we looked, everyone was eligible. Was a drunkard. 
kama mmoja alikuwa anaolewa kwa mtu mwenye fulani kila siku huyo simia alikuwa ana kujanga ho kwa anajanga ho every day is so hard Thank you. 
Because they are looking for a preacher. Because of a big belief, he ran with the risk of people following him. Night after night, following God, night after night, not because they love him, but because they want a preacher. Patriots, when they were tested, 
They say to their hearts, I would rather be with a gift giver than be with a gift. When they were tested, when Moses was tested, when Abraham was tested, when John was tested, they declared